Welcome to another video. Make sure y'all mash the like button as soon as y'all come in the building. So a lot of people are unhappy with Alexis Morris getting waived, LaDasia Williams getting waived, and other players getting waived that's pretty good. And you're having people starting to speak out about it, including LSU President William Tate, who made a, a statement pretty much saying the WNBA needs to do better. Check out what he had to say. Remain quiet when my students were released. No claim of sour grapes here, but the WNBA business model is suboptimal. Players are better served in college or other transparent options to aspire. I hope this market learns to tap into the passion of college women's basketball. And we're seeing that college basketball on the women's side is starting to pick up a whole lot of steam. We've seen like LSU, a lot of people going to the games, um, best um watch statistics on espn when iowa played lsu so people are starting to really really tune in to women's college basketball people are starting to watch um the wnba too they had one of the highest ratings last year ever but they need to do something about adding teams and giving more opportunities for players to be able to play because there's too many players getting cut that deserve an opportunity alexis morris Maybe couldn't have been a starter, but is a solid player off the bench in her first year. There's no way she should have got cut, waived. But it's just not enough teams. And they need to kind of do something with the business model where they can make it where there's more opportunity for more of the women to play in the WNBA and succeed. And I know we're going to hear about the finances and, you know, a lot of teams are losing money and the WNBA is losing money. But they're going to have to come up with something to fix that ASAP. I'm out.